Hey guys, it's Phasma back with another video, and today I'm showing you some skin combos for the new Boba Fett skin right here. I'll be telling you guys how you can achieve all the things that are used to make these combos, and I will also tell them. I'll also tell you guys like which ones are not available anymore, so on, so on. So, first of all. Right here, we got the Boba Fett skin. Um, pretty sick, pretty sick. Can be purchased in the item shop for 1,500 V-Bucks, and the bundle, I believe, is 2,800. So, I favorited all of these. And, I'm gonna start off from number one, the Hunter's Trophy. This is not achievable anymore. It was the back bling for the secret skin in Chapter 2, Season 5. That was achieved by challenges. See this next one right here is called the Manta Pack. It can be purchased in the item shop. Not right now. It's part of the um, Black Manta bundle from the DC series. It might come to the item shop soon when there's another DC skin. It's pretty cool. I like this combo. Next one is the Ancestral Bloom, which is one of the first things you unlock in the battle pass with battle stars this season um really all styles can do but i prefer to go with this last style this cape right here it's pretty clean although you he kind of already has this like skirt looking cape thing down here if you don't want to like wear that all right next one is this back bling the bale basket and there's a skin called the Bayo Bros, and this is the back bling that comes with it. I believe it can be purchased for 1,500 V-Bucks in the item shop, but this skin is not available right now. Next, we have the Trot Shot, which is in this battle pass currently. Um, it's one of the first things you unlock as well. So you could do that and that, but they don't really work with the skin, which is why you should unlock um, in the battle pass the style for the skin that this comes with which I believe here we'll check this style is achieved on page 4 right here alright next up is the the Wayland Yutani cat carrier and basically um it's pretty clean and every so often a cat will pop out which is kind of funny um you can see the cat do this little thing on the side there it's popping up um this can be purchased with the ripley skin um with in the R ripley and the xenomorph bundle from alien and it comes to the item shop every so often so yeah you can still obtain it it's kind of rare it comes to the i believe it's um came to the item shop a couple times but it returns every so often next is the galleon gear this is no longer available this was the chapter 2 season 6 um like season starter pack that was purchased for four dollars um yeah back in chapter 2 season 6 there's this other style but i it doesn't really go as well i think and this style goes better Next is the last kiss. This is part of the siren skin. You buy this with the siren skin that comes in the item shop like a lot. It's a pretty common back bling to get. Next up is this one, this skin right here. Um, this back bling works, but also this one works as well. Just why I had it on. And it's bought with an 800 V buck skin that kind of looks like a mechanic. Um, it's 800 V-Bucks to get that in the skin. Um, no, it's a 1,200 skin, actually. Excuse me. Spark plug. Alright, next up we got this tie, bow tie, which was, it's actually not really available now. It was introduced back in Chapter 2, Season 3, and it was with the Save the World bundle. It's no longer available. Same as this one here. The Turk versus Riptide backling, which I believe 
It's my um, personal favorite out of all of these, which I'll use for a combo. Pretty clean. Chapter 2, Season 1. Um, Battle Pass. Bundle. Nah, Battle Pass. Yeah, Battle Pass. Back one. So next up. Um, we got the, this, the Beast Fang, which looks, um, decently good on the Boba Fett skin. See the colors match. You can switch the style to this Harpy's Claw or the default. Got the Combat Knife, which is just a kind of a regular knife, so it goes with any skin. The IO Eradicator right here goes decently well with him. Uh, the yellows on his skin matches. This one right here, that um, this was available in Chapter Two, Season Eight, Battle Pass. This was Battle Pass Chapter Two, Season Seven. This is Battle Pass also. So all these that I've shown you so far are unavailable. This was an item shop skin. Um, it comes back every so often. It's part of the Terminator bundle with the skin. Um, comes with it, yeah. Next up, we got the power claws, which go pretty well, um, especially if it's this style, because you see it matches the green and red. Pretty sick. Um, you can do the claw, the clobberer, or the power claws, but um, to be honest, this style goes like all right. It goes pretty well with him, but this one goes a lot better. Um, final thing is this Mark Mallets. It goes like okay, kind of. It's kind of just like um, it was for uh, challenges. This was Battle Pass. This was challenges back in the summer, so it's not available anymore. But it goes decently well. All right, moving on to gliders. This works very well the foundation umbrella the glider right here this is you have it no matter what it's a free glider you start off with foundation umbrella was achieved in chapter 2 season 6 by getting a victory royale no longer available now so next this one right here works very well the io stealth sail um battle pass not longer achievable so does this, if you go to the last guy, this one actually works really well with this skin. Also, this one, you know, it's a rocket ship one. Boba Fett has the starship, the slave one. And really any other Star Wars uh, series glider goes good with this. I could really only find one contrail in my uh, locker that fits with him. Well, I kind of found two. I found this one that's no longer achievable, and this one right here, the drop jet. And for the wraps, any green or red wrap really goes well, like this, this, these are some pretty good wraps I found, yeah, this worked kinda, but um, yeah guys, that's it for the video, um, this is Prasno signing off, hope you guys like this video, and so long.